So let's get started by installing the boilerplate application. I'm going to navigate over to my GitHub profile. Here's a link to it in case you lost it already. GitHub.com slash Stephen Greider. Then I'm going to click on the Repositories tab at the top, and I'm going to find the repository called Redux Simple Starter. Now there's two ways you can get this repository. If you're familiar with GitHub, you can, or excuse me, if you're familiar with Git in general, you can go ahead and copy this link right here and use git clone to get the entire repository. If you're not familiar with git, don't sweat it. You can go ahead and click the button over here that just says download zip. That'll get you all the files inside of this repository inside of a single zip file. I'm going to go ahead and get this repository by cloning it. So I'm going to copy the link right here, flip over to my terminal, and write git clone and then the link. Cool. Next, I'm going to change into this new directory by writing cd redux simple starter, and now I'm inside of my project. This project has a bunch of dependencies that it relies upon. It's not just a bunch of raw JavaScript files. It has a lot of tooling underneath it that we need to install before we could actually run the project. To run the project, we're going to use node package manager. So we'll write npm install, and that's it. This process is going to take just a little bit of time, so I'll catch you in the next section when the installation is complete.